So yeah guys, check out this vet. It's a 73. Same as the one that I filmed about a month ago. Oddly enough, also an unusual color like the other one I had filmed. If you guys follow a lot of my videos, the other one I filmed was more of a modern electric blue. Uh, kind of like the uh, that chick's t-shirt over there. Kind of like that, but this is really strange. Uh, I think this is actually an original color, original GM color. Might even be original paint, I don't know. Probably not, but what's very strange also is the, the color of the interior is this dark red. It's a, if this is all original, it's a very odd color combination. And I uh, uh, wish I had better eyesight to see the mileage. Hmm. 350 probably. Very odd indeed. But I really think this is the original color because just today I was looking on Kijijiva and dreaming as I often do and there was a 74 Impala or Caprice convertible for sale with a very similar color. So, uh, you know, even in the 70s these type of baby blue type of colors were, uh, were pretty popular. That's one of the things I like about Corvettes for many years because the, the windshield design, the wipers were in, in that uh, in that fashion, you know, versus versus being, you know, uh, parallel to each other, I guess you could say. Right here, the old orange julep here in Montreal with the lots of seagulls and it's hot as hell. Probably still 31, 30 degrees Celsius. I wish the owner was here. I'd like to ask him about that color, man. I can see the door jam is the same color. Very interesting. Very interesting. This is the only one I've ever seen this color. You know me, I'm always looking for stuff that's different, you know? Hey, there's your fuel, uh, fuel door there, gas door. Now what's also interesting is I think 73 was the last year where you had the uh, the chrome metal bumpers and you see in the front one was fiberglass and it would stay like that but the rear ones were still like this which is kind of odd actually. I like those chrome exhausts, they're dual exhausts. Right on! Uh, hey is that yours? No way. Man, uh, one day I'm going to run into the owner, I want to ask about that color, it's very unusual because if that's the original color, it's very rare for these kind of cars. There's a gentleman right here, I'm glad he, you know, he started talking to me because he's got good eyesight and I don't, he says he could spot the orange peel in the fenders, which means this car was probably red or orange before, I would say red. And also check this out, you ever seen this on a sun visor? Look at this, that's the original GM. Look at that, starting procedures, can you believe that? Like it's some <laughs> rocket motor in there or something, you know, a turbine, you know? That's crazy. Look, I didn't even notice this. Look where you got your windshield washer tank. They're gonna size that thing. Shit, that's good if you live in BC or something. Or, uh... It's still, uh, but it's still cool. You know, it's a Corvette. It's an American legend. Ah, wow, it's awesome. I think I saw this guy leaving here one time, man. The engine was running rough, though. She don't get really? it. Right. Yeah. But then again, maybe I'm wrong because look, all these wires. That's all new, man. Yeah, he's got an all MSD ignition system. Yeah. So that's. Uh... Oh, everything looks new. All fucking hose all new. Yeah, yeah. Alternators probably new. Where the hell's the battery in the trunk? Probably in the trunk. Eh? Uh, yeah. 